Hey kids, Inverted Cal here, and welcome back to Imperion Iron Man Season Clickbait. <clears throat> I am still undead, level 12 now. Uh, 63 so-called kills, although there has been much more than that dead around me. Uh, the Harvester... Turn off B. There we go. The Harvester is performing quite well mowing down tons of aliens, Xerix, and other critters and mobs that need to be killed. Uh... I have, however, stumbled into something totally unexpected. The crashed MS Titan mid and front parts. Where I logged out last night was just over in this area here somewhere. I came around these mountains down this way and I had to cross. I worked my way north because I had lots of red dots showing up on the north. Uh, I was also heading towards this derelict base where I was running into all those Xerox patrols. And I hit this, or spotted this abandoned reactor. So, I know this isn't a base with surface guns on it, so I got a little bit closer and triggered this MS Titan mid part and this MS Titan front part with the rocket drone on it. Uh, there's also a small promethium deposit here. The last one I did, I got like, I think it was 68 ore out of it. Um, not exactly overwhelming amount of ore anyway. It was 60 or 70 ore. Uh, 57. Well, 57 plus... 10 crafts of Promethium charge, so yeah. Uh, <clears throat> not exactly uh, game breaking. Deposit sizes. Uh, made up a bunch more ammo because I am running very low on ammunition here. Because all the critters, creatures, and things around here are spawning it. Now you'll notice down on my hotbar there, at spot number five, I have plant proteins. Found this food duplication bug last night uh, and reported it to Imperion, but if you order a whole bunch of these energy bars, it will produce, as long as you're, uh, you have multiples of these plant proteins, it will keep producing energy bars out of these plant proteins. Um, kind of a cheaty bug, so I thought I'd bring it to everybody's attention. I had uh, about half a stack of these and I ended up making an entire stack of bars out of just a couple of these. I should have only made about 10 bars and I was, it, everything went rotten at I think I had 50 bars at that point, or 40 bars. It's a stack and a part. So it's a stack is 20, so yeah, it's 30 something bars anyway, out of a part stack of plant protein. So yeah, they expect the patch for that to come up sometime soon. So I figured I'd bring you in to see if we can take out this MS Titan here. Now I've been slowly drilling these ore deposits here as well, uh, these surface ores, um, with a hand drill, which is very tedious. What I'm trying to do is get close to this thing without triggering that rocket drone. Cut that tree. There we go. Oh, spiders. The whole area is just crawling with uh, 
critters and spiders and all kinds of nasty. There was a cannon or drone flying around here, or a minigun drone flying around here earlier, but I think my miniguns might have already chewed it down. As you can see by the uh, corpses in the area. I have uh, overlords, overseers, whatever they're called. Good for a little bit of contaxit um, off of them as well. Not that I need it because I can't warp, but I can use it for one of the ammunitions. I think it's plasma or something that uses it. Um, and I, again, I'm getting to the point where I have so much meat. I have so much meat and food that it's getting a little ridiculous. That's why I always say I don't even bother with harvesting... Um, food. Okay. There's two guys and a laser dude over there. Now, the part of the reason I like the MS Titans is they're a large amount of material in a fairly small package. Um, like there's a, a, a good base here to start with. Oh, come on, turn around. Where are you, Mr. Spider? I hear you. I don't see you, but that's not surprising. Go away, son, you bother me. Just trying to land over here. I'm just going to actually land. I'll turn off the parking brake. Jump out of the cockpit. Do something I don't normally do. I'm actually going to go over and pick this guy up. Apparently, these guys actually do drop their weapons periodically now, although you can't get the weapons with the drone. You have to pick them up by hand. More spiders. Spiders are very annoying. Not particularly difficult, just exceedingly annoying. Oh, uh, is that the core right there? I know they changed the core locations on all these. Yes, that's the core right there. that spider. I don't see that spider. That doesn't mean anything. Bad spiders. All right, I have to grind some spiders for a few minutes.
Okay, anybody else? Huh. Crickets and overseers and everything. the hell just something just took a couple of pot shots at me I'm just gonna take one of these guns and we're just going to put it on predator Spiders and the big butt bugs and everything else that's flying around out here. I just want to get into the Titan. That's all I wanted to do today. I'm asking for a lot. Okay, try again. Turn on the parking brake. Open the fuel tank. Throw in some gas. you feel throw the meat in the fridge all right I heard the Xerox guy Armor upgrade, very nice. Uh, tier two projectile pistol. Well, I might just put that to use. Thermal upgrade. Yeah, jackpot, baby. Woohoo, heavy armor. Yeah, you guys were fighting to keep the good stuff here, weren't you? Oh, I've got a lot of drilling to do. I don't think I got enough room to get under on these ones here, do I? Now, the Titans have uh, a lot of thrusters and other components hidden on them, which is a big part of the reason I want to get this one. I got to deal with that rocket uh, jerk off there, and that's what's got me concerned. This whole section of Titan here, however, I am just going to literally tear down. Uh, I'll probably throw a core in so I can get the thrusters off in one piece, but everything else. Uh, I think some of the hardened metal I might try to get. Oops, fall through a hole in the floor. That's always a good thing. But I believe the part I want is the MS Titan back part. The front part is... This one has the bridge deck on it, I believe. Um, and I think the front the front piece has the growing plots on it. So if you want to base build a base using the Titans, the front one is your best 
best part for that. Uh, the back one has the best loot. So that's kind of what I'm after. So I'm going to skip ahead a little bit of drilling and grinding here, and we're going to work our way over to take out that rocket drone. I'm going to keep the core software running just in case anything interesting comes. I'm going to pull that off. I'm going to switch to the medium armor because the amount of hostiles in the area. And I'll put on that multi boost and the armor boost. I literally cannot kill these things fast enough. That is funny. Shot down the rocket drone. I still can't get close enough to it, but I'm working on it. Managed to make it to the front part. Spiders are in droves, literally cannot kill them fast enough. Okay, is that almost everybody? Another spider. This is the front part now, right?
one jetpack. This section here has all the garden plots. They're all buried under all this dirt. It's really, it's, I think that's the only real loop that's in here, is the gardens. Again, this one, this is one I might just come and tear down and dig out. Um, if I was going to build a base I might use this one but as I said I'm probably just going to go straight for a capital vessel over a base so I'm just going to finish digging this door out hopefully at some point in time the rocks will start to move hearing the minigun just chewing up ammo like that because normally it means it's just shooting a glitched creature or it's trying to shoot something through the earth or through a solid object or whatever. It's just wasting, wasting ammo. But if you turn it off and let it just go on its own, then you get mauled by uh, all sorts of bad stuff. there's anything there is I think there's a fridge or something up here that might have some food in it uh, over by that light over there I'm not going to worry too much about it and I don't think there's any real inventory in this piece what on god green earth are you wasting all of my ammo on seriously it's dead already Once again, gun turrets. Default setting, AI, stupid. back part. This one's right up on the beach. That's funny. shooting out the windows. So we got a weapons bunker over there then. I don't want to get too, too close to it. Because I would imagine that's part of one of our POIs later on. I'm taking damage from my own gun turrets here. Can't shoot through my cockpit, preferably not through me there, gun turret. I really don't appreciate that. If 
you don't mind, I'm trying to get up this hill without getting shot. What the hell am I hooking on here? Seriously, what the heck am I hooking on here? Probably some stupid twig or piece of debris. Mind this stupid there. go is up here because there's the core that locker is the Robertson protocol locker victory locker whatever it is this one is another locker and there is a loot barrel in the elevator shaft usually right there feeling I'm going to want a new drill so we're going to order that first before I do anything else we'll clear that weapons and items get me a new drill I might be able to jump down in here Yay, we finally managed to get through all that dirt and the doors.
Oh yeah, did I mention there's a loop barrel over the core? Steel blocks, cobalt ingots, cobalt ingots. They're very nice. And some fuel packs. An EVA boost, yeah. That's what we will be needing for when we get to outer space. And finally, another armor boost. Oh yeah, heavy armor and two armor boosts. I am almost set for combat. If I actually had some guns, I'd be all set. Ooh, three control panels, nifty. All right, let's send the drone out. And we will go pick up the last of the loot. Some more ingots, a tier two assault rifle. I told you I'd get one of these. Some more explosives and another tier two projectile pistol. Okay. And this side. There it is. More explosives, three solar panel blocks, a handful more steel blocks, and a bunch more ingots. there is one on this side. I could be mistaken as well because it's been a while since I searched these. Yes, there is one over here. More explosives, some magnesium powder, some iron, some more steel blocks, and another couple of radiation pills. Have you ever used a radiation pill in this game? Ever intentionally like I've never had radiation to the point where I needed to use a pill in fact I've never actually had radiation to the point where I actually had to do anything about it it's usually all I get is the thingy clicking away and I move into a different location or wear better armor or I don't go there but there we have it so that's the back part. Now this does have, uh, I believe, a couple of large thrusters. It's got some small thrusters or medium thrusters in here as well. Um, there's a couple of large thrusters and a couple of the purple RCS units in here, the advanced RCS units. So this is a good thing to take apart for parts. But it is in a very interesting location because it's perched between two water bodies. I got a clear line of fire on two, two fronts. I've got that mountain ridge there. I could probably reach that peak with a connect to base gun turret. And then I would have a elevated gun platform all the way around this valley. 
and it would be nothing to clear cut all these trees out of here and give me a good firing arc probably all the way up to that Prometheum deposit so anything that spawns in this area would be dead uh, very quickly and yeah there should be a lot of good fuel in this water get into it probably not from up here so I might look at utilizing this as a command post for a while until such time as I have to move on to um, space <clears throat> so there we have it thanks all for watching kids um, I'm going to unstick the harvester here and probably go collect some more goodies and resources try to do so without getting killed in the process here and I'll see you on the next episode where I will have converted probably converted part of this into a functional build uh, or fun functional structure um, the bridge deck up there I might reinforce I'll put some reinforcement bracing down put a floor on between these two pylons and open them right up take all the thruster bits out um, that should give me all the building space I need for pretty much anything I want to make looks like I got a lot of drilling to do though just level that hill and hollow this hill out just to dig the ship out and I'll get the component pieces out of here that I want and then I'll clear out this thing and pick up harvest that or deposit and harvest those other two components get them done and then from here we'll start building a attack vessel to deal with these nasty bad guys so thanks all for watching i'll see you on the next episode where we've got this thing functional as a base good night for now